Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be tackling five of the custom rally stages I've built here in Forza Horizon 5 in this uh, Alpine A110, um, which if you've watched recent streams you'll know I use this quite a lot. It's a very fast A-class um, dirt racing tune um, that I've got downloaded on this Alpine. But yeah, we're going to go and uh, take it onto five of the rally stages that I've built recently here on Forza Horizon 5. So the first couple you might recognize from previous videos from the last couple of weeks where I went in and built some custom rally stages, but there are also uh, a few at the end that you won't recognize because I've not shown them. Uh, I didn't want to show time lapses necessarily of everything. thought it's kind of better if we, in future, go more to the point and I just show you the route after it's finished. Um, so that's what I'm doing with a couple of those. But yeah, I thought we would combine that with a few of the previous routes I've made as well uh, and go on a bit of a, well, few rally stages uh, in the Alpine. So we kick things off with the La Silva Rally, which is a 3.3 mile stage and all went pretty to plan when I built this, apart from one checkpoint that sits on top of the tyre bundle for some reason. Second up, we move to the Ek Balan Rally around the ancient templed temple ruins here on Forza Horizon 5. It's a 3.5 mile stage and you have to dodge the tyre wall at the beginning a bit because it's not quite where... The car doesn't start quite where I expected it to when I built it.
third up is the Playa Azul Rally, which starts a little way out of the town on the tarmac um, part uh, and runs for 3.2 miles. And nothing really went wrong with this blueprint. Everything kind of ended up where I wanted it and nothing really broke. So this is the first one that kind of went entirely to plan. So that was the last rally stage that you may have recognised. These next two are totally new. Um, I haven't shown them on video before. Uh, this fourth one is the Tio Tehukan rally or something like that. Uh, it's 3.1 miles and you start a bit beyond the start line. I thought the car would start a bit further back than that. Um, but apart from that, it went pretty smoothly when I built this one.
and last but not least, the Horizon Wilds Rally, which, yes, at some point does wind its way through the Horizon Wilds Festival. This is the longest uh, rally stage I've made at 4.2 miles, um, but it does have some high speed sections at the end, so it takes a little bit longer than the others, but not as much as you might expect. So there we go, that is five of my custom created rally routes raced in uh, an Alpine A110 with an A-Class rally tune on it. So as I seem to say at the end of all of these um, custom route videos, um, as soon as we get the feature to go back and edit these, I'm hoping it means we can go and edit existing blueprints, not just new ones that we make, um, but yeah, then I can fix things like the broken checkpoints and move the start gates so that they fit better. Um, but yeah, I've kind of gradually learnt a bit how you have to place props to avoid some of those problems occurring. So yeah, they do kind of get slightly better as we go on. And the one rally stage I didn't include in this video was the first one I made and that had far more problems with it. But anyway, those are five rally stages that I've created here in the game run in an Alpine A110. So yeah, I hope you did enjoy that and like the look of them. If you do, um, share codes were obviously up at the beginning of each stage if you want to go and give them a go. Um, but yeah, let me know if you enjoy this kind of different style of video. And I'll potentially, if I make more custom routes, put them into videos more of this format so that there's more routes showcased and I don't um, waste time showing a sort of time lapse of building it because you've probably all got an idea of how the root creator works now so it might be better just to show you um, the finished result um, but yeah that is going to be all for today's video running five of my custom blueprints uh, in the alpine a110 so thank you very much for watching and i'll be back with the next video very soon mm -hmm.